kept getting ads for it on Instagram. It literally kills me. Um, this one. Good morning and happy Monday. Pretty much at the beginning of every week, I like to do like a little refresh slash, slash reset of everything. I just like to clean up a little bit and get a lot of stuff put away and all of that. We had some family stay with us over the weekend and usually I just kind of like spend the weekends not cleaning my house anyway, just to take a little, you know, break. So I am wanting to today just kind of get the house put back together and clean up a little bit. But the first step is that I need to go pick up my groceries, my grocery order. It was at 10 and it is 9.49, so I need to go. And then we will be right back. Hi, Molly, yeah, the trunk is fine, thank you. Okay, groceries are put away, and now I'm just gonna tidy up a little bit. Like I said, my house isn't too bad right now. It's just all the weekend gunk that I need to figure out. Just clutter, kitchen clutter, living room clutter, all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to put on some music, and let's do this. Alexa, play my Spotify worship playlist. Worship from Spotify. read my devotional, which I normally do like first thing in the morning when I get up, but it's honestly kind of hard for me to like focus or anything when my house feels like messy. I don't know. I feel like probably a lot of people relate to that. I just feel much more at peace and enjoy my morning time once the house is taken care of. So I'm going to make my coffee really quick and yeah. So side note, but my skin is still just, you know, pretty terrible as you can see. Um, I decided today, you know, just to do a no makeup, let my skin rest a little bit. I don't even know if you can see me in this angle, but whatever. I'm just making my coffee. Um, yeah, so I'm letting my skin rest a little bit today. I just have on sunscreen give her a little bit of a break, but nothing seems to really help, but you know, that's okay. It's all worth it for this little boy. So I just got home from the thrift store. I woke up today and I just had the urge to go. So I only got a few things, but I feel like I scored really good. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got really quick. Okay. Okay, so first I just grabbed a couple books for baby boy. This one, Good Night Moon. This one, and this one. I like ones that kind of look like vintage-y, cute, like that is adorable. And then I found these gold hoops. These are really cute. Um, I've been really wanting, I had some gold hoops and I literally cannot find them anywhere, but these are really trendy right now. And 
and I mean, yeah, that's all I need to say about that. This I got to put on top of Baby Boy's dresser with like his diapers and wipes and like his creams and stuff like that. I actually already have um, a little basket up there, but I don't know if something about it just wasn't the right vibe to me. So I'm gonna try switching it out with this one and see if I like that better. And then the real star of the show, this was $5.50, is this like charcuterie board wooden masterpiece, beautiful item. I was so excited when I saw this and I fully expected this to be like, I don't know, like $15 to $20 and it was $5.50 and I was like, you're definitely coming home with me. Also, while I was there, I saw the literal cutest, sweetest, best little vintage high chair i'll insert a clip right here which the thing is is we actually already have one and we got it from the exact same thrift store and it's so cute too but i feel like the other one's better and also we're planning on like sanding it down because it has like stains and you know i just want the more natural wood look anyway um and i feel like this one would be easier to sand down than the one we have so you guys should tell me which one you like better i feel like we need to go get the new one i can sell the old one probably for like really cheap on marketplace and the new one is only like i think it was like 9.50 i mean it's so cute it's so cute anyway um yeah that's all for now i just got this package in the mail from addy joy co and I figured I'd open it with you guys really quick because I'm really excited about it. Also, here's where I put that wooden tray charcuterie board type thing that I got at the thrift store yesterday. And I think it looks so cute. Okay, so my hair is literally crazy. Please just ignore that. I have never ordered anything from them before, obviously, because I have never had a child before. <laughs> but... Okay, their stuff, I kept getting ads for it on Instagram, and I was influenced, so I'm really excited to see. This color is a little more pink than I was expecting, so this is like a little set. Oh my goodness, that is so cute, and the little pants, oh my word. I wish it wasn't so like pink looking. So this is three to six months. It looks big to me, but haven't had a baby before. So we'll see. But yeah, I wish it wasn't so like pinkish looking, but it's kind of brown. It'll be fine. Oh, this is a little bubble romper. Oh my goodness. That is so cute. This is also three to six months. Also looks huge, but this one I know for sure is supposed to be like oversized and this is the color oatmeal, and I think that is really cute. This is 6 to 12 months. I think this is more of like a summery one, so I tried to get like 6 to 12 months guesstimating like what size he'll be by then. Oh, this is nice. It's like waffle knit. Oh my goodness. Little t-shirt and not little shorts. Ah, that literally kills me. These are so cute okay this stuff might be my favorite stuff that i've gotten him so far so definitely recommend addy joyco this quality feels amazing too and yeah definitely glad i ordered this stuff oh if you're interested i got all this stuff hopefully they're still doing it it was on sale i used the coupon code i think summer but i think you should say on their website or on their Instagram, but basically um, they're doing 20% off their whole website. So I got all of this for a pretty good deal. Okay, I think I'm going to end this video here so I can get it edited and uploaded for you guys today. Um, I am planning on still posting on Sunday. I'm hoping to maybe kind of start doing two videos a week, but I'm not 100% sure I'll be able to maintain that, but I wanna try. So you guys should definitely let me know if there's certain types of videos that you like seeing or that you wanna see and i will definitely make them for you so anyway thank you guys so much for watching um please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you aren't already i really appreciate everyone who likes and comments and all that that really helps out my channel and makes me feel good so thank you guys so much and i'll see you on sunday bye